Hi everyone, welcome back to your art class. Today what we are going to do is we will make a alphabet. Now we will draw the alphabets using the grid. So this method you will be learning today. Like using the grid, you will be drawing the alphabet. Alphabet usually like for. Uh, a b c d the normal size alphabets we will be using three grids like one two three and five one two three four five this will be the proportion of taking the uh, making the alphabets and for making uh, alphabets like m w you need a bigger size and for that we will be using five by five so that is one two three four five and then one two three four five so this is the method for what we are going to use. So for that first you need to take your A4 size paper and draw the grids. So take A4 size paper. This side of the paper will be 21 cm. So what we will do that is like we will mark 0.5 cm from both the sides. And we will join those lines. I mean, do those dots. And we will see. We will make the drawing here like to correct one centimeter will be coming that not more than one centimeter. So we will start from zero here and we will still end at 29 here so that we will get each boxes. That is the point. See the point is starting from zero here. I'll show you much closer. We we'll start from zero and we will end at 29. So arrange it in that way that it will be in the middle of the page. So both the sides you will do the same thing. And then you will have to join both the Ends. So that way we will get the border for the paper. Now you will have to mark each centimeters on all the sides. If you are starting from this side, start down also from this side. Make sure that then only the line will get aligned. So you will mark each one centimeter from here and when you go down the same and do marking on all the sides here one centimeter and when you are if you are doing it from uh, this side from here one centimeter you are marking and what you do go down same way and mark each one centimeter Okay, that way when you draw, you will get a grid like this. You will get a grid like this. So after that, what you have to do, you will just see, you will start numbering, take a different color pen. Here I am using a red pen. One, two, three. Leave one line. You have marked one, two, and three, and then you will be leaving this column, and then again you will mark one, two, three. Leave one, one, two, 
थ्री लीव वन वन टू थ्री एंड अगेन लीव वन वन टू थ्री सो टोटल यू विल फिट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सेट्स विल बी देर ओके फाइव सेट्स विल बी देर सो लाइक दैट यू हैव टू डू एंड देन ऑन द अदर साइड यू विल मार्क वन टू थ्री फोर एंड फाइव One, two, three, four, and five. And again, leave one and do one, two, three, four, and five. Again, leave one, one, two, three, four, five. Leave one. Leave here only four will be coming, and you can leave that portion. No need. You will be need needing like to do the same thing on. Two papers. So we will start off. I will tell you this is one, two, three, and one, two, three, four, five. This is one set. Okay. This makes one set. So like that you have to see. So we will see how to draw the alphabets. That is this one set. One, two, three, and one, two, three, four, five. So this is. the set now we will see how to draw the alphabets so now we will see how to make the alphabets for making alphabets mostly it is coming with straight lines but there are some curves also so we will see the different types of curves first for uh, small curves you will be dividing like boxes the way inside thing we will be dividing the line into half like put a dot there and uh, put a dot in here and joining that two with the curve will make in smoothly the inside circle and for the bigger circle, bigger i mean like the outside curve it will be corner to corner so it will be coming this way wide curve so that is this is inside curve like center to center and then from corner to corner corner mostly makes the outside curve this can be this side and the other side also so like that are the two types of curves now we will see how to draw alphabet a we will you know this is 1 2 3 and this is 1 2 3 4 and 5 so we will have these grids like that on your paper and you have marked it like 1 2 3 and 1 2 3 4 5 5 so you will select two points here and two points at the corner here and here one point at the top in two points at the top and two points at the bottom and then you will join it the straight line that makes the outside of the a and you will join it at the top here and you will join it to here these boxes now we need to find the like from the two second box second uh, column uh, second row you will have to mark a center point here and you will join this to there but here you will go till here only and from here again you will go till here same way you will do it on the other side and then you will close it here and here so that makes alphabet a it's clear now we will see how to make alphabet b be the same like we will draw straight line from here like this is straight line here we know that like inside it is here this part will be straight and the middle also this part will be straight those two lines we will draw after that here till here you will draw straight here also you will draw straight now you know like there are two type of uh, curves coming here inside it will be small curve and outside it will be big curve so for that we will go straight from here till here 
and till here you will go straight from here you will be making a curve from corner to corner here also you will make corner to corner okay now then you will go straight here and straight here now in this box you will find the midpoint here somewhere and you will draw with a curve here and again a curve to the down part now we will make the inside curve for that center point here here and on this line this line center this line center and this line center you will find now you will join them here you will be joining it straight to that line i mean that dot then you will make a curve and again a curve dot 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 straight here straight here curve and a curve so that makes b now c we will see c will be like we will start from this is 1 2 3 so we will start 1 2 3 4 5 this is the second column second third row i mean third column second row you will draw a line in the middle here again on the fourth one you will do the same thing like this we will draw a straight line here straight line here here will be a curve small curve so you will put a dot here and here same way you will do it on the other side also down side we will join with the curve again with the curve here curve and curve then coming straight you will join this two part now outer circle i mean outer curve corner to corner here also corner to corner in this side also corner to corner corner to corner straight straight and straight that makes c <clears throat> now we will see e is very uh, simple you can draw straight line all the way if you can if you want some modification you can add a little bit extension here and a small curve here that is what i have done in my sheet so you can do it that way i will be attaching it for the post material so you can refer to that picture and complete it so that makes e f is same you rub this part straight it becomes f Okay, I is just you will draw the same thing. F am I going to go alphabetic order only? Okay, G will be same like uh, C, like starting from here and this way and this way like that. But you will for the down part you will be come on one second I'll go. Big curve, big curve. straight the curve straight the curve here you will go till up I mean like here will you will be going and then you will go here this is a small curve here small curve here and you will come till middle here and uh, that extension will be shown here that makes alphabet g so that makes alphabet g now h is very simple 
it's all straight line that makes edge use your scale while you're drawing and i you will draw it in the middle and it's very simple now j is again simple we we'll start from the second here it will be a big curve straight a big curve you will come a little bit up and here it will be a curve to the middle and again a curve straight that's it that makes an alphabet j for k you will draw a straight line and here you will join from this corner to here and then you will draw from this corner you will just try to keep it as parallel from here so like that you will join to here and for the down part you will be drawing from this point to the corner and here Uh, you try to keep it as straight like that makes the k understood from this point to this point you will be joining and this line will be drawn parallel starting from this point it will be parallel to this line and we come and join over here okay then here it will be just starting from this corner i mean this joint and from there to this corner and this will be drawn from this point towards this that will be like parallel to here and stopped at this point it's clear okay now we'll go for l l it is simple you will have to draw like this that makes l now comes the big letter where we need five boxes so we will see how it is done that is alphabet m so how you will do that is you will draw one straight line at this end and a straight line at this end okay then here you will close here also you will close now we will see the middle box this is one one two two this is the middle one you will draw a line over here also so that makes the down part here also you will have to draw so these are the outside lines now we will go for the inside one this line will be going till here only so draw a line over here till the second box same on the other side till the second box okay now what you have to do you have to join this point to here join this point here to here and this point to this corner so that is the way now middle line we drew that box leave that box and the next box we will select the center point there and from there you will go to the up joint there so that makes alphabet m okay now we will go to alphabet n again it is very simple straight line on both the corners here you will close and here you will close okay and even this side you will close here also you will close and what you do from top this side you will draw 
two boxes down from this side two boxes up now just join this corner to here and this corner to here that makes alphabet n so that's very simple now we will go to o o is same like c big curve we will draw the corners all the outside corners first corner to corner all the sides four sides you will have to draw corner to corner then join them with straight line now inside you will mark all center join the curves then again straight so that is o and if you are making q it will be just a line here from corner to corner you will draw a line and you will just go beyond this line little and this way and join so that makes q okay now for p Also straight. Here it is a curve, straight. Then a corner to corner curve. Here it is straight, straight. Till here, like B, we are drawing half of B. We are drawing. So that makes P. So making R. After drawing P, what you do from this corner, you will go out, and from this corner you will go. That makes R and rub the inside portion. So that makes R. You can make a modification if you want. Like you can go a little bit outside the box also. Lahar will be coming like this. Goes a little bit inside. You can go and from there you draw a little inside and then from here you can go a little bit out and that way also you can draw. this way you will be able to create your own fonts now we will make a difficult part of the drawing that is s follow along with me and there will be no difficulties like we we'll see here we are not using any big curves we are using all small curves so first what you do we will make the outside curves all half marks we will make like this all half marks are been made so like this and then join them with a curve okay now the starting part of s will be a little bit above from the middle like C only what we did not uh, not not like C like E so we will be joining here joining here also and here also we will go a little above below the middle and we will join side with the straight and this side also with the straight so that is a half way of the outer curves. Now we will see the other side. Now here we need a straight line only. So, so we did this much. We will draw straight line here and a straight line over here. Now we need to make the curve on the sides. This side will be here and the this side. Like this is the back side. This is the front side. So here it will be up. Okay, yes, like this we are writing. So this side it will be up half, and this side it will be down half. 
you will join with a straight line here join here a curve and a curve for the inside curve you will be marking on three sides half and joining them with curve and then join to this straight line here also you will do the same curve curve and a curve and a straight line so that makes alphabet s you can make a change if you want but this is the basic model i'm telling like the basic design you can make your own uh, type of fonts then now it comes t t is very simple all straight lines here that makes t now then we will make u u is very simple again top it will be two closed and down it only one closed and a big curve on both the sides inside it will be half and half and half curve and all straight that makes u now v it's like ulta a only we we'll close here and here and here and then join corner to corner here you will be in the middle you will find the midpoint here it's just like a only the other way of a now w again we will see how to make w for making w listen carefully we will close at the top here and again we'll close at the top here now down we'll take the second one here also we'll take the fourth one now we will have to close in the middle here too okay now we will join with the straight line from this corner to here from this corner to here now in the middle what you have to do is you will find a middle point over here in the third one the middle one or else you can just draw it till there only and draw it till there only and this one will be joined in this corner to there okay this also that way you will join stop it at that point and stop that means inside now for the back side of the w again you will be coming somewhere in the middle only so you just remember to stop it at that point stop there and stop that makes w i will show you once more we closed it here and here top 3 and down 2 now what we do we will join the sides okay now here you will have to see the third row midpoint and you will be drawing a straight line from this corner to this corner but will stop at that point okay from here also it is the same we will start from here and we will stop at that point here you also you see the set the point you will stop there and from this corner to here you will stop at that point here also you need to find a center this is the center the third third one third third row third column so you will join from this corner to this corner but stop at that point again you will start from this corner to this corner and will stop at that point that makes w that is w and it is very simple now we will see x x is very simple again you will have to draw from 
I mean close it here, here, here and here. Now this corner will be joined to this corner but you will stop there, here, stop there and you will continue it from here to here. Yeah. Now from this corner to you will join stop there and you will join it here and stop there and you can drop the extra part. From this corner to down. that makes alphabet X. Y is very simple that way only you will be doing you have to rub the extra part and then you will draw a straight line over here down that makes Y. From this corner to this corner first you draw till the middle of this line like one two three middle you will draw from here you will draw a line to this corner and stop it here. This also this way you will stop it here. Here it will be drawn till the corner and but stopped here. Like that. So that makes Y. Now we will see how to make alphabet Z. Z we will start a little down from I mean little above the center. Here it is all straight, straight and straight till here and here do the same on the other side here just below the center point yeah. and this line now you will join this corner to the inside corner and this inside corner to the outside corner now that makes alphabet Z so all the alphabets are shown you need to draw it I mean like this and uh, make the grid with pencil draw the alphabet first with pencil and then make it with a little thicker markers so that that alphabets will be standing out and you need to fill it with the colors okay so that is the activity for uh, this week I will share this picture in your class material you can find it there and uh, for reference you keep it and submit it. Thank you. Have a nice day.